SNP leader Nicola Sturgeon said she was bursting with pride as she joined her party's newly elected MPs to mark its landslide election victory in Scotland. The 56 new Westminster members posed for photographs with their party's leader in South Queensferry, overlooked by the Fourth Bridge. Ms Sturgeon said ending austerity would be the first priority for SNP MPs. The SNP celebrated unprecedented gains, virtually sweeping the board by taking all but three of the 59 seats. Labour the Lib Dems and the Conservatives won only one Scottish seat each. At the event Ms Sturgeon told a gathered crowd of supporters she was bursting with pride that so many SNP MPs had been elected. She added, the people of Scotland have spoken. They have placed their trust in the SNP to represent them in Westminster as well as Holyrood. These 56 SNP MPs will represent the interests of all in Scotland. She called the SNP's victory in Scotland unprecedented in UK politics and added, people voted for an SNP manifesto that had ending austerity as its number one priority. That is the priority these men and women will now take to the very heart of the Westminster agenda. It cannot and will not be business as usual when it comes to Westminster's dealing with Scotland. My message today to Westminster is this, Scotland's voice will be heard in Westminster now more loudly than it has ever been before. The new crop of SNP MPs includes former SNP leader Alex Salmond, who won the Gordon seat, and 20-year-old Mary Black who defeated sitting Labour MP Douglas Alexander in Paisley and Renfrewshire South.